Good evening, everyone. Along with Eddie Olchek, I'm Mike Emmerich, and an air of expectancy about this game because when you walk through the turnstiles and you go up to your seat, you know you're going to get to see the top point getter in the league, and that's a thrill. Who doesn't love to see goals and points, Doc? And when you have the leading scorer in the entire league on the ice, he's going to get a lot of attention from the other team's best defensive players. Let's look at the starting netminders. Tough outing last game, but he'll look to bounce back in this one. Matt Murray, in his first three years of pro hockey, he won five AHL and NHL honors, plus a pair of Stanley Cups, and all before he turned 24. And they are ready for the opening face-off, and so are we. Chen's the starting center for the Blues. Crosby's ready to draw for the Penguins. Mid-year, another chance to build statistics individually or team-wise. Let's see who does it tonight. Face-off has been taken. Pitching it to Tarasenko. And now it's directed to Schwartz. Shifts to the backhand and shoots. Nearly grazed the iron on that. Keeps it in the zone with that interception. Snapping a pass to Gensel. Gains the zone. Good intercept in his own end. And he dumps it in. Goes back deep for it. Fires. Save. A great speed bump set up there. St. Louis has it between the blue line. To Crosby. Pitching this one to Rust. Steps in from the neutral zone. Gathered up again by Hornquist. Looks ahead to start something. Pittsburgh's lugging it up the wing. Passed in the corner to Malkin. Good place. They score! Now that the scoring's been opened up, we'll see if the opponent can punch their way back into this game. You can't be back on your heels too long. That is the first goal scored after a lot of work. Great start. They were ready to play, and it shows on the shot clock as well. The Blues win that neutral zone faceoff. A slot wrister took that right away. And he's hammered. Mott is on a mission out there, clearly trying to set the tone physically for his team early in this first period. Rister from the slot. Save. The Blues skated up on the side. It's dumped back in so the defense can come off and get a rest. Passing one off now to Haglin. He's in on an onside play. Got that pass off the boards. Back and forth they go between the points. Save. He gets that squeeze to those pads and play stop. Pittsburgh's coaching staff is always prodding their players to be more aggressive, to finish checks, to separate body from puck. They don't have to tell him. He's always among the highest hit totals in the league. Solid win of the draw. What a save. I was looking for the light to come on. He knew what was coming, and he got right in its path. Moving it to Thorburn. Directing that one to Barbashev. Around through the corner. Gathered up again by Johnson. The Penguins are driving it from the wing. He just fanned on it. Pass. Quick shot. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. Pass attempt to Barbashev. That was a big hit. Better tighten up the brain bucket. Not afraid to get physical here tonight. It's dumped in. And it's a good pickup. Looking to Malkin. Skates it into the zone. On to Edmondson. Cuts off that pass in the attacking zone. 
Laid on to Malkin. Puck ricocheted off the screen. Outstanding body contact. Oh, broke it up. Terrific determination by Bormeister. Thanks for joining. And the whistle signals an offside. The Penguins prevail on the draw. Steps across that line. And down to Bukestad. Stole that pass at a critical end of the ice. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. We're in the last minute. Let's see if anything changes. Doesn't get the shot off. Pittsburgh's along the wing at center ice. Good solid defensive play with the stick. That is up close and personal. Shen's going to have to pick himself up after that one. He got steamrolled. They clearly got the target on him. First period has been completed. And so, intermission activities are forthcoming, but the players get a breather. Pittsburgh's connected once, and that's the only goal. Hey, fans, don't forget to enter tonight for our team signed poster, which will give way before... The Penguins have a lead. It is just one, and they did it this way. We'll be right back. First period has been played, second period about to start. A look ahead. The Blues come into the second period trailing on the scoreboard because they didn't possess the puck much in the first. They'll need to change that and their approach if they want to win this game. Period two has begun. Ray Ferraro is closest to the action. And the old Jack is alongside Mike Emery, who is truly upstairs. Now it's steered up the wing to Schwartz. Shoot. Oh, what a chance, what a save. Rister gets a piece with the glove. That. Diffuses the attack for now. There are a few ways to stop the momentum against you. That's one way. Cover up and reset. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. They took that draw and won it. And at an angle to Petrangelo. Got that pass in his own end. He cleared that puck out of there. St. Louis has it in the defensive zone. Is able to move on in. Pittsburgh's cleared. A lot of work, but penalty time less and less now. Gets it out. From his own end on the power play, it's taken by Alex Petrangelo. And he dumps it in. Solid work there by Schwartz. Wonderful stop. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Oh, what a hit that one was. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. Terrific determination by Schwartz. Puck is thrown to Tarasenko. Punched away. The net comes off, play is stopped. Johnson's not one of those guys you expect to give a big, heavy hit, but when you slow it down, you really see the force and the impact. Clean win on the draw. The Penguins shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Perron's trying to do way too much there with that offensive opportunity. Tries to get it on net. Wonderful stop. The Blues with possession in the defensive zone. Tremendous 
this hit. Ooh, that one's gonna hurt. You get jolted in open ice, it hurts. Has it picked up. Takes that pass at center, see if we can move something. Very important if he can clear this puck out. Set on further, they'll have to return. St. Louis will play it from their own end on this power play. Great poke check there. All a part of generating an offense. Little pass off from the goal. Loose puck, it went off some. Shot it back out of his own end. The Blues will play it from their own end on this power play. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. And that one is cleared. More time off that penalty clock as they drop back and wait for another rush. Waffle boarding. And he shoots one. It's blocked. He's got this one, and they're after him. He's shown us quite a bit on that move, didn't he? That puck gets out, and so they can get that line change. The power play unit has to recoil and try yet again. Broke that play up at center. Perfect, Brister. Oh, lightning quick and a terrific save. And on top of that, another great stop. What quickness side to side. Got to clear it here. What a tremendous hit. Tarasenko's never been shy about staying in the guts of the game. He's a skilled player, but he's not afraid to throw his body around. Pass comes to him from the crease. Heron's cut through the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Good save there. In the slot. Outstanding save with the glove. Some people call it the glove. I call it the trapper. Great save. Murray stretched out as far as he could go. He just got a chunk of that shot. Over four minutes have gone by in the second. The Penguins lead 1-0. Nice face-off work. Gathered up again by Alex Steen. Great save. Trying to go to Johnson. Moved along and in. Outstanding save made off a terrific chance. What a terrific opportunity. Save there. Score! Oh, no! The referee's waving it off. No goal. Plays under review here, Doc. They waved it off immediately. I'm not really sure why they need to take a second look at this. Face off and a solid tie up and help arrive. Good job. No time to react. Didn't need it. Save. Now that's a solid save. Pitching it to Rust. Can start the attack going in the zone. Perfect save. Shoots. Got his glove on that one. Now it's directed to Rust. That one comes right on his stick. Not very long, but good. The Penguins' penalty kill has been terrific. That was a long one. This should pick them up. Snapping a pass to Tarasenko. Fires a shot. Terrific shot, but a save. Scooped up. Shoots one. Grabbed. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. Special gift tonight from the team. It's a colorful free scarf. Everybody gets one. The Penguins with a face-off win. Intercepted that pass in the slot. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over him. That was a good challenge. Better stop. Important interception there. Snaps one. Crashed into him in open ice. I love that hit. That's old-time hockey. Fabry's banged up here as he works his way back to the bench. I can see the trainer working his way down to his end. 
from the outside. Great save. On the outside, a shot. Great stick there. Pitching this one to Schwartz. Propelled to Bozak. Bumped, loses it. Passing one off now to Gensel. Oh, snaps the shot. And a save. And he puts the glove on it and stops playing. Fabry's injury is apparent as soon as you see this hit. The collision was fierce. The puck's dropped, and that's a great job tying the man up on that faceoff. It's dumped in. And moved down to Sunquist. Taken over again. Shoots that pass ahead. Breaks free. Great save. Shutting down one of the best. And decides to just cover it up and get the whistle. Good reach there. Ah, oh, that's a good quick poke check there. He retreats now, getting back to his own end. Jab deeper to Thorburn. And angled to Edmonton. The battle for the puck, and he can't get free. Guards the point well, doesn't he? Wonderful block. Slid to Barbashev. They score! And they've tied the game up. going to spread out. That goal ties it. The teams are so evenly matched. St. Louis has scored late here in the second to get this game tied. A thrilling third will be coming up. The Blues with a center ice face-off win. By number 70, Lane Hillman, assisted by number 49, Pittsburgh's back in its own end, trying to work forward. Shoots one. The lane was jammed, and it hit somebody. Hatchets one. Just missed the net. When the puck sounds hard, when it hits the end boards, that means you've missed the net. Scoring chances handed away. Pittsburgh's coaches have been prodding them to play a more consistent brand of hockey. And while that's been a struggle at times, for the most part, They've been as good as anybody. They continue to put points in the bank even when they don't have their A game doc. As a result, they lead the league in points. That is interesting, Ray. There's a lot to live up to for them in this game then, isn't there? Perron's taken a huge hit, but he's continued to make the play. Good job on the draw. The Penguins arrive at center. One minute left. In the Into the last period. minute of the second period. Got that pass in his own end. That puck flopped out of play, bounced from one row to the next. But a very adroit fan from Chillicothe, Ohio, has a souvenir of the game. They've taken that face off between the blue lines and won it. Wonderful chance to score, but no. That puck's loose up. Good defensive play. That's two periods in the books. One more to go, but a rest comes first. As is our custom, we look now at the shots on goal. Wow, does anybody play defense here? 18 for the Blues and 18 for the Penguins. 
fan club and receive a membership card, discounts on team merchandise and team ringtones, as well as email notifications on upcoming... St. Louis has gotten this game tied back up, and that goal came late in the period, and you see it here. Right back after this. Both teams have found the back of the net, but it's even underway here in the third. Wonderful chance was set up, and the pass just goes wide. Solid bad save. Let's it go, and still another save. What a show. Amazing reaction. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Chen's lost again, one of a bunch. Tight game, cuts that pass off. They score! That's two unanswered goals. here in a tie game. Now they've got the lead. We'll see what they do with it. St. Louis has scored to go in the lead by one now. Let's see what happens before the end of this period. Perhaps they can win. Perhaps it will be overtime. Moving it to Kessel. Number 91, Vladimir Good grab again. Time of the goal. Takes that pass from the other point man. Whoa, what a play! From a slaughter wrister. Can't think of a better save than that. Schwartz can't do much wrong with the puck these days. His point streak will continue. We get a glimpse at it here as he has been a dynamic player both with and without the puck, whether scoring a goal or setting a play up. They won that face off, try to generate something. The Blues skated up on the side. Flings it, just threw it into his pad there. Carries it on in from center. Let's it go, save! Nice work by Malkin. Took that away in his own zone. Offside, stops the clock. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Just a bit under six minutes have passed, third period. The Blues have a one goal lead. They recently broke the tie. Chip to Steen. Let's it go. Save. Great. Poke check. In with it now. Score! And the game is even. I guess at this point, guys, it doesn't really matter what the game looks like. It's back to even square, and we'll find out who's going to take the lead next. Pittsburgh's gotten this score tied, and there's still time in the third period for more excitement. From the faceoff, and they lock up in a good reach. That's help from the wing. That's a good save and goal. They're going to have to come up with something better than that. And yet another save. How does he do that? 
I don't think the shooter got much on this, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick stop on a relatively easy shot. They won that draw. Gathered up by O'Reilly. Smart recovery by Phil Kessel. Directing that one to Gensel. On to Crosby. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. Fantastic setup and equally great stop by the goaltender. Really easy stop for the goaltender. Down in the butterfly, he's able to control that shot. A little under nine minutes skated here in the third. The winds have shifted yet again. This game is back in a tie. Pittsburgh's got it again. Great save. He scores! A pair of goals by the same team. You fight so long in a tie game. Now you've got the game-breaking goal. What do you do with it? I think you attack. You try to get another one. Or at the very least, you don't let your opponent breathe. The Penguins have broken the tie here in the third period. What will they do next? How will they start to play this game? Aggressive, passive. Pittsburgh goal, scored by number 19. Let's a shot fly. Two wide. Pass attempt to Hornquist. Looking to model. Puck is thrown to Rust. The Blues lucked that along in their own end. Brings it in for an attack. Trying to go to Rust. This game is going to wind down and be close right to the final horn. Each team has tried to enforce their style of play on the other. It's just not happened. Laid on to Rust. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. Two players splat to the boards. He was looking to finish his check, and he lines up his man right up against the boards. A big hit in open ice. Another reason to like this game tonight. Brings a shot. Oh, great save. It stays out off the inside of the post. The Rangers will be next on the menu here for the homestand that the fans are thoroughly enjoying. Over six minutes remaining in the third. The Penguins lead by a goal. They just broke the tie moments ago. Quick wrist shot. Sticked away. Oh, that was hard to follow. Pitching it to Petrangelo. St. Louis looks up from the wing. Now it's directed to Petrangelo. Let's it go. Deflected off the blocker. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a faceoff right near him. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Shen's ripped off on another faceoff, one of many. His team trailing here. Crosses that line. Shoots. Just missed high. You have to hit the net in that area. Great stick there. So back to center ice they come on that offside. The Blues control from the neutral zone. Shot on. Oh, what a club he's got there. They've got it again. Collected by Bortuzzo. Snapping a pass to O'Reilly. Dogged determination there by Johnson. This is setting up for a dramatic finish, and it may take extra time. One of their best players, it doesn't matter how many chances that they've had against them. He's kept them in the lead because his play has been exceptional. A big win. Let's
let's see what happens. Perfect tip by the stick. Good job with the stick. Pitching this one to Perron. Propel to Latang. Fires. He scores! What an important goal in the game. They've got a two-goal lead. necessarily how hard you shoot the puck, but it's the release. What a beautiful forehand shot. Well, sometimes you just have to say that's a great move, both once on the forward, once on the goaltender. The Blues from the neutral zone start to work. Goalie to the bench, substitution made. Good shooting place. Blockered away. Justin Passing one off now to Rux. The Blues with a neutral zone possession along the way. That one's flopped in. Puck loose now picked up. An enormous hit. You think you have your helmet strapped? Net empty. Score! Quiz goal has put this one away for sure. Time to go home. The empty netter will wrap this thing up. And they won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. Right to the point. Slid to Petrangelo. Oh, a save there. That pass is cut. And the game is over. Well played, it was. Pittsburgh's got a win, and their winning streak keeps going. This team has been hot as of late. They're following their game plan. It's resulting in wins. So ends another game and another telecast. We hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.